This is Ubuntu 22.04 running GNOME desktop. Previously, I installed GNOME with Ubuntu 18.04 and that is very old. So, in this video, I will walk you through setup GNOME desktop with Ubuntu 22.04 and also it doesn't require any root privilege. So, go to this repository. This is the script by one of our Discord members to install any distro in Termux using any rootfs. So just copy this command and go to Termux and paste it. Now this as you can see where it will install rootfs for ARM64. So go to this website and here are the rootfs for Ubuntu. So as we need for ARM64 and here it is. So just long click on that and copy link address. Now go to Termux and hit enter. Paste the URL and again hit enter. Give any name to your distro and enter. Now it will install Ubuntu and will also fix sound. So give it a moment and it's done. Here is our launch script. We just execute bash and the launch script. Now first we'll add colors here to remove existing .bash RC file and copy a new one then execute following and exit. Now here we need to make few changes in the non script. So just open it, nano ubuntu.sh, scroll down and here after dev, hit enter and paste following. Then just save it with control x, y and enter. Now login again. Now first thing you should always do is to update your repos, f update, then execute following. This will install minimum gnome desktop. So give it some time and it's done. Now we have to configure VNC server. So create a VNC directory mkdir.vnc and open xstartup file nano.vnc slash xstartup. Paste following in it and save it. Then give executable permission to it. And finally start the VNC server. Now go to VNC viewer, click on this plus icon and here write your IP address colon 1 give any name to it and click on create connect enter your password now here just click on this i icon scroll down and change picture quality to high and here is our gnome desktop but we don't have wallpapers here and also display size is not according to my device so just right click display settings and here change the display size according to your device and click on apply Keep changes Next, go to background and select your wallpaper. But one thing that is missing here, and that is our dock. So click on activities, show application, and launch the terminal. Now install GNOME extension. Then again go to application and launch extension and enable Ubuntu dock. And here is our dock. I know that this doesn't look like Ubuntu dock. We will fix that in a moment, but before that, these icons and things doesn't look like Ubuntu 1. So again launch the terminal and execute following. Then one more install. Now close the terminal and launch GNOME tweaks. And change cursor to Yaru. And icons also and theme also. Now it's look like Ubuntu. Next to fix this dock, launch the terminal and execute following. One more command and now it's look like Ubuntu dock. But we are missing one thing here and that is our browser. So by default, if we execute command to install Firefox, then it will install it from step, which will not work. So we'll add Mozilla VPA repo here to just execute following. And one more command to install it from Mozilla repo instead of snap. And that's it. Now we can install Firefox. App install Firefox dash Y. Now just go to application and here is Firefox. Right click on that and pin it to dock. Now just launch Firefox. Oh, it's crashed. So go to about colon config and search for sandbox.ubeb. And here click on this plus icon. Now again search for sandbox and here is what we need. Click on this pencil icon and change its value to zero. And click here. Now just close Firefox and launch it again and it's working. Now to get sound here, just launch the terminal and execute following. 
So that's all for the video. Thanks for watching and consider subscribing.